Hi, this is Brian Stark, and I'm going to show you how to find and manage your guidance lines. These tips are handy for renaming, deleting, and creating offsets. To find the guidance lines, make sure you have the correct year and field selected. Now click on GIS and the Guidance Lines tab. If the Precision Ag data that was uploaded included guidance line data, they would appear here. The area to the right of the map gives us important information for each line, including name, length, and date created. If you click on these headings, it will change how it is sorted, which can be handy if you're dealing with lots of guidance lines. By clicking on the name, the line will turn blue, giving you the exact location on the map. You can also do the opposite by clicking the line on the map. Either option works. To rename a line, click on the three dots and choose Edit. Enter a new name, maybe something that might be a little bit easier to understand for the operator, and click Save. To offset a line, click the three dots again and choose Offset. Give this new line a name. If you enter the original implement width and the new implement width, the software will automatically calculate the offset. Or you could just change the net offset and ignore the other two options. The offset direction is relative to the path from point A to point B. You have two options, left or right, which will place the new line according to that direction. For example, we need to shift our planting line and this new line needs to be located to the right or to the east side of the original line. Since this line starts at point A and moves down to point B, we need to make sure to select left from the drop down and click Save Offset. Our new planting line appears and is ready to use for the next field activity. If using AutoSync with Trimble Precision IQ displays, these updated guidance lines will automatically transfer or you can write them out to a display via USB of your choice. Thanks for watching how to manage your guidance lines and make sure to subscribe to our channel to be notified of future videos.